Hey guys, it's Mike, the editor of 40 Plus Fitness, and today I want to give you what I think is an important video. At least I hope that it spurs you to do some research on your own. If you're taking any of the products that I'm going to talk about here today, you may think it's a controversial video, you may not agree with it, but I hope that it at least encourages you, like I said, to do some research. I want you to understand that uh, if you're taking a product that is most likely a workout booster that has DMAA in it or 1,3-dimethylamylene or may see it called geranium extract or even methylhexamine, uh, if you say that three times fast, you, know, you need to understand that the FDA has issued a serious health warning on this product as of April 27, 2012. And I would really encourage you to, to really do some research on your own to see if you want to continue to take these products that have this ingredient in that because they've been linked with 42 different types of adverse events, cardiac disorders, nervous system disorders, psychiatric disorders, and death. Now, some people are going to dismiss this and some of these claims by saying, uh, you know, maybe they've done some research and, you know, one of the things that was associated with an incident at a military base where a couple soldiers died and I guess they took, you know, way too much dose of the product at the same time. And sure, that would be stupid to do that. But the bottom line is the FDA does not issue a health warning unless it's a very serious situation. You know, a lot of times the FDA doesn't even get involved in these workout products that a lot of us are taking. But when they're going to get involved and issue a health warning, it's a serious situation. So again, I would encourage you to do your research. The products that were um, the FDA actually sent out warning letters to these particular companies to notify them that this warning was coming. And two of the most popular products are ones that I've taken myself. Jack 3 d is on that list, as well as 1MR. And there are some other ones as well, too, I'll read off to you. Biorhythm SSIN Juice, Lean FX, Spirodex, PWR, Napalm, Code Red, Hemo Rage Black, Lipo 6 Black Ultra Concentrate, Lipo 6 Black, Lipo, Lipo 6 Black HERS Ultra Concentrate, and Lipo 6 Black HERS, as well as Methyl Hex 42, Nitric Blacks, and Oxy Elite Pro, which is also by the manufacturer of Jack 3D. So, again, um, some of the things that have been associated with this, like I said, are, are problems with the heart, problems with the mind, problems with the nervous system, and people are dying from it. And um, as I said, these are supposed to be natural stimulants, but if it's going to have a negative effect like this, you know, I'm not necessarily comfortable taking that anymore. You know, unless you're going to be a pro athlete and get paid millions of dollars, why would you want to risk your health like this? So uh, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, but I do want you to be aware of the situation so you can at least like do, so do some research on your own. I will tell you that the makers of 1MR, uh, I believe that's BP, have actually already changed their formula and they have a new formula, which they're actually calling the original formula. It's not. It's actually a new formula, which does not have DMAA in there. It has some other ingredients. And I have another video all about that particular change because I do like that product. But for now, I just want you to be aware of if you're taking a supplement with DMMA in it or one of these other ingredients, it's the same thing. 1,3-dimethylamylene, mexylhexanamine, or geranium extract. Please do some research and see if that's still going to be considered a safe product for you. Thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Mike with 40 Plus Fitness saying thank you and God bless you.